Carbohydrates contain both sugars and starches and are found in many of the foods we eat and are measured in grams. Carbohydrates are broken down into glucose, which is an important fuel for your body. Insulin moves glucose to our cells and acts like a key so the glucose can get inside our cells to be used as a fuel. We know of course that balancing carbohydrate and insulin helps keep your blood glucose in a healthy range. The first step in carb counting is finding out which foods contain carbohydrates. So which foods contain carbohydrates? Anything sugary like sweets, desserts, pastries, biscuits, cake, ice cream, regular fizzy drinks and even natural sugar like fruit, fruit juice, milk and yogurts. Anything starchy like potatoes, chips and crisps, rice, pasta or noodles, breakfast cereals and oats, bread and crackers or anything made with flour, grains, legumes and beans like barley, lentils and baked beans, and sweeter vegetables like sweet corn, peas, squash and sweet potatoes all contain carbohydrates. Foods without carbs are fish, meats and eggs. Most vegetables like lettuce, cucumbers, broccoli and cauliflower have a small amount of carbohydrates but in general are very low. Also margarine and oil are accepted as having no carbs. Although cheese, cream and butter are considered dairy products, they contain little or no carbs. The items to watch out for are foods that have carbs added, like breadcrumbs on fish fingers, or those sausages and burgers that have had breadcrumbs added to their mixture when made, and soy products like veggie burgers. Because so many foods have some stray carbs in them, it is really worth always checking the food label or a reference guide as you learn about what items have carbohydrates in them. Why not test yourself? What have you eaten today with and without carbs?